A family devastated. Mkoli Sisokacha's death is described not only as a loss for his family, but also for his friends and colleagues within the ANC. He died in a crash that involved a truck and two vehicles. The horrific accident claimed the life of a woman while four people were hospitalized. Oh, this gentleman, uh, he was a humble man, a humble man. The guy who always cracked jokes with his family, always liked to gather with his family, more special his wife. His wife is always number one wherever he is. He always talk about his wife, Nolvuyo. 57-year-old Sokacha is a former MEC of Public Works, Health, Social Development and Arts and Culture in the Northern Cape. The former MEC served in the Portfolio Committee of Health since 2019. We have agreed that the funeral will be on Saturday this coming weekend. I think it's the second. So it will be the funeral will be on the second. And uh, then there's a memorial service that will be held by the ANC on uh, Wednesday. Uh, then the other arrangements, as I'm saying, that we have those final details, we've already planned them as a film. But the two important things maybe that I can talk to now is that the funeral will be on Saturday and the, the memorial service will be on, 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 on Wednesday this week. Because on Saturday, on, on, on Thursday morning, we are intending to go home to Richmond. That is where you will be laid to rest. Okay. ANC chief whip in parliament, Pemima Jordina, and other ANC officials are expected to visit the family to pay their last respect to Sokacha's family on Monday. Police have opened a case of culpable homicide pertaining the accident. Tabi Sokadebe, SABC News, Kimberley.